with your tracks and being followed by circles you can now go into compositing mode in the layout selector and be sure to use you know use nodes in auto render and because then you will end up with this if you have set up your scene and the properties not to render sky then your circles will be transparent on a transparent background which is very important for the way we rig our filters um, the alpha channel the visibility of the circles is used to describe where the filter we use for anonymization is being applied and, you, uh, <coughs> and these nodes describe what the composite view will be for rendering um, the composite view will join the movie and the objects defining the filter spaces so we add a new node to add our movie with shift A it's an input movie clip and we already have one in the history that we take <coughs> now um, Now we take um, an alpha over node, which is uh, available in color. Shift A, uh, color alpha over to tell the um, the node to differ between the alpha of these. So we take the alpha of the circles and the image of the movie clip. If we have hit F12, the uh, frames will be synchronized. So we don't need the image. Okay, that comes later. Okay, to experiment with... Um, actually, the, the preview down here shows you what will be rendered. So if you hit render and there's nothing in video editing, um, you will see this in the end. But black circles are a bit brutal if, if you're interested in facial expressions and gaze and eye direction. Um, so we try to find something more subtle. Uh, for this I have investigated a few hours in researching filters. Uh, if we shift A, add a filter, filter and put it on top of the path we can tell Blender to use the Sobel filter, for example. And now we use the original image as an image for the background and the output of this filter as um, the filter to be applied where the circle overlaps the video. Okay. Um, we duplicate this node by shift D, drag and drop and then taking the output of the first filter as input for the second. Uh, a double circle is not so nice. We take a Pruitt. We downgrade the circle to 33% and the Pro to 0.75 and for good measure you see the the colors are very very different so difficult to distinguish for good measure we then use a bit Laplace which smoothens out the color distribution over the features um, shift A oh no just shift D to duplicate this one place it on this path, select Laplace, apply the full potential of it and there you go. We have normal colors again and the features are just blurred and sharpened enough to still be seen. Um, and in the small previews you see it's easily uh, easy to tell which direction I, I look 
and if my eyes are closed or opened uh, even in the small previews and this one doesn't even uh, doesn't even project where my eyes are directed and still my features are quite removed from what they really are if you know me um, you might actually be able to tell if that's me or not if you've visited me you will definitely be able to tell but this is enough I think for anonymization um, alternatively you can turn the Laplace filter a bit down um, which makes the features harsher, uh, harder uh, or you turn the uh, Sobel up, which makes them kind of redundant, Dif difficult to distinguish. Yeah, try to play around with these filters. Um, I also uh, checked the filter Dilate Erode, which kind of does this um, it, uh, I, I think it's it's too much uh, the eyes are not very clearly uh, indicating where where I look if I turn the other back on you will see that I actually do not look extremely to the left I look kind of straight and that um, is something we miss if we go uh, this way with the dilat uh, dilation um, okay but rendering again is um, try to do it from the default view because uh, all your settings are viewed uh, in one pane you see the output is set the presence uh, presets is uh, quick time with mp3 uh, encoding hit render and all is well animation and then you see frame by frame how this is rendered it doesn't go quite as fast as in the first example but this is how you do it with the advanced filters okay